Good morning, everybody, and welcome to Drew in the Moment. We are here in Animal Kingdom to have some fun. It's a little stormy today. Uh, they're talking about potential tornadoes. Uh, yeah, I don't know if that's going to happen or not. Uh, we didn't realize until we actually got to the park because we didn't look at the weather because we were just too excited to get out here and just enjoy Animal Kingdom because we haven't been here in a while. We want to thank you for checking out the video and let's go have some fun in Animal Kingdom. Look at Divine. She looks divine. So awesome. So graceful. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. That was amazing. See, the storm doesn't bother her at all. So cool. Always amazing to me. That is so cool. <laughs> Where'd she go? I can't see her. Where'd she go? <laughs> oh my God. So here we are at the Tree of Life. I'll tell you though, seeing Divine is always so much fun and because uh, you can't really catch her all the time. She only comes out for a little bit, but uh, oh, always so much fun. I hope you guys enjoyed that. And I hope you guys enjoy this video today. We don't know how the weather is gonna be, seriously. Uh, as you can tell the skies, it's not a sunny day. Is it Queen V? Guys, no, hey guys. Yeah, no. Queen V, in case you guys are new to the channel, my lovely wife. She's the brain, the brains of the welcome, operation. Welcome to the channel, guys. And what should they do when they come on in? They should boop it and subscribe. That's right, that's right. To help us keep going and, and keep growing. Right. I didn't screw that this time. <laughs> you didn't screw it up, and I'm proud of you. High five. Uh, but yes, we love Animal Kingdom. Haven't been here in a little while. Uh, and because Earth Day, or excuse me, Earth Month here, in the park is what they're celebrating. They have a little snack over at Pizza Fari, and I'm so excited. Should we go get the snack right now? Yeah, let's go. We shouldn't waste any more time. Before it starts raining. Before it starts raining. Let's go get <laughs> yeah. everything before the rain. All right, let's go get that delicious uh, little snacky poo. We just love the theming in Pizza Fari. It is so nice, so vibrant, and I am so excited. We came here initially for the cupcake. But now we're also gonna get the gnocchi because yes. I love gnocchi. I love gnocchi. I don't know how you guys feel, but I love gnocchi and it's a new thing. So I'm like, why not try it? They also have a drink, so we might get that. Oh yeah, they had a Granny Smith apple type drink. So maybe, yeah, maybe we'll do that too. Maybe we'll get wild today. <laughs> so we got our food. It's looking good, man. Oh, it's so good. Look at this. We got our uh, gnocchi, gnocchi primavera. And I just, before we get into this, it is so windy right now. I start to feel it's a sprinkle. A little bit of the sprinkles coming down, but so we gotta we gotta eat. We gotta eat yes. before the rain comes. But this looks great. A little gnocchi primavera. Mm -hmm. Check out the cupcake. Oh my goodness. Because this is initially what we came here for. It's got my favorite uh, animal of all time, the elephant. And I don't even know, I didn't even look to see what oh, flavor. I have no idea. We're gonna have to look that up. I just saw I had an elephant. I was like, we gotta get it. I was like, we gotta get it. And then look at this thing. Look at this. It's like, uh, you know, Granny Smith apple with Sprite and gummy worms. I love gummy worms. I feel like they don't have gummy worms as available as they did when I was a kid. Let me know in the comments if you've noticed that. Like. I look for gummy worms and I'll find like brands that are not the real gummy oh, worm brand. Go. They're kind of like these weird off brands, but anyway, uh, it's game time. What are you I, gonna try first? I gotta try the Noki, man. I'm, I'm, I'm hungry. 
I'm hungry. Mm -hmm. I'm hungry. So, uh, oh, oh, and uh, the cast member did tell us this is vegetarian. So, oh, that's awesome. so in case you, you know, you're vegetarian. Oh yeah. I love gnocchi. Look at that. Oh, it's so cheesy and delicious. Here, you grab a bite. Let's do this together. We're gonna do this together. I got my gnocchi. All right, here we go. Bing! Mm. Oh, man. So oh, man. It's so good and mm. warmy and cozy. That is so good. That is so good. There's not, just so you know, there's nothing wild. <laughs> I use it. Wild. Ah. We're at Animal Kingdom Wild. No, but there's nothing crazy about this dish. It is like, like it's basic, but in the best possible way. Just that, you know, the sauce, nice tomato sauce with delicious gnocchi. It's like homemade almost. It's like homemade, yeah. It's like almost like homemade. That's really good. I'm giving it, I'm giving it five thumbs yeah. up. Me five too. thumbs Me up. Too. You know what I mean? Solid, solid. Solid, you know? No, but I always like to let people know, because uh, not everybody is uh, courageous or, or adventurous when it comes yeah. to uh, trying. like trying foods and stuff. So I get it. But it's that way. You can't go wrong. You can't go wrong. Yeah. Oh, we didn't so, bring napkins. I brought napkins. Okay. Yes, I did. I have them in my okay. pocket. Uh, whoa! Plates are flying. It's getting crazy here, man. Yeah. But uh, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I really do, and uh, I want to thank you guys for checking out this video. I can get this thing going. I'm gonna let Queen unwrap that because it always has that cardboard around it. Yeah. Nobody wants that. Nobody needs that. Oh, this is tricky. Okay, I got it. Oh, I she got, got it. it. She got it. Oh nice God, work. I, I don't know what I do without her <laughs> telling her. I'm your assistant. Well, I feel like I'm your assistant sometimes. <laughs> okay, so you can take my. Oh okay. yeah. Oh my goodness. It's almost like, oh, I'm, I'm gonna get this all over my face, guys. All right, here we go. Yeah. You know what? Yeah, take a little bite. Put it down. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a little bite. I'm gonna take a little bite because it's very hard to. Okay, so far, I, I think it's a, a basic Ooh. vanilla cupcake. Oh no, it has a, it has pineapple inside. Mmm. It has, sorry. <laughs> okay, so it's a it pineapple. A pineapple, okay. Uh, what does it say? Intelligent elephants and cupcake features, a delicious. The elephant is white chocolate atop a graham pineapple. cracker cupcake and pineapple filling. Oh. Graham cracker. I'm not really getting a lot of graham I cracker out of that. I want to see if I can get the pineapple. Oh yeah, there it is. Okay. I got some of the pineapple. Okay. It's not an abundance of pineapple. Mm -hmm. it, it's a little bit, but I, but I'll tell you right now, that's a no. I, I like it. Yeah, that's a yeah. really good cupcake. Um, I, I don't. There it is. I can taste a little bit of that graham cracker. I can taste a little of the graham cracker. Mmm. That is really good. And it's layered. It's layered. But uh, I have to admit, I would get that again. I actually would. And I'm not a huge cupcake guy, but now let's try this bevy. Cheers, prost, salute, slanch, everybody, to just enjoying the day, spending it with all your loved ones, and uh, just just having fun, man. Having fun with your life. So here we go, let's give it a whirl. Woo! Wow. Um, here, you, you try some. I'm not the hugest Granny Smith apple flavor. Oh my goodness, it's delicious. So she likes it. I uh, I'm okay apple. with it. I'm okay with it. I wouldn't get it again just because I'm not a Granny Smith apple kind of guy. Have a sip, guys. Have a sip. Have a sip. And. Of course, I gotta get my gummy worm on. Wild. Mm. Best part about that drink? The gummy worms. That was delicious. Totally worth it, wouldn't you say? That that was totally oh, worth it. I recommend you guys trying at least one of the items. Uh, but we are gonna walk over here because 
we saw they had a red kangaroo out and about, so I want to see if we can see the red kangaroo. We are favored with fortune today. We have the kangaroo. Look at that red. So it's a red kangaroo. He just, just kicking it. He's having a little snack. That little snacky poo. Kangaroos are such wild animals. Like, it's a kangaroo. It's so awesome. Like. It's, it reminds me of like a big bunny, almost. Seriously, <laughs> it is getting very windy today. Good thing we brought our umbrellas because I think uh, I think we're gonna get hit with some rain. But let's get a better uh, better view. Oh, look at him! He is adorable. Oh my gosh! Look. But doesn't it look oh, like wow. a, like kangaroos always remind me of kind of like a large like bunny or rodent or something? I don't he know. Itchy tail. He had an oh, itchy yeah. tail. That is so oh. cool. Oh, it's a bird coming the way. Crikey, mate! Look how big that tail is. Oh, and then we got a bird walking on to walking onto the territory here. So cool. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh my god, he's so cute. I miss the baby, the, baby the, baby the baby kangaroo. Check out this lemur. That's awesome. So cute. The, I, I don't think I've seen them out like this in a very long time. Wow. All three of them. They might like the weather. Maybe that's what it is. Maybe they just like. We want to chill outside with the with the wind and the rain. Those are beautiful animals. And of course, on this video, we had to show some animals, seeing that we're at Animal Kingdom. <laughs> we are here right below the uh, Tree of Life. Beautiful little waterfall. But look, I found another kangaroo. It's not moving now. I don't know why. But as I saw that kangaroo, I realized how large. Like, get up near that. I want to I show how large that rhino is, man. Look at that. That's insane. But yeah, I love it. In case you didn't know about the tree of life here at Animal Kingdom, there is a ton of animals that are like, you know, hidden, carved into the tree. Really cool to take some time to check it out. It's not a day at Animal Kingdom without seeing Kevin. One more he returned, nobody knows. Kevin looks beautiful today. Somebody's having a good day. Oh my god. He's probably out exploring in a little bit of turnout. That sounds about right. Yeah, sounds like him, right? Maybe he's playing fetch with us. I always want to see the little, uh, the little wings flap. We have to find him. That's a good idea. Well, that's because we're all at the same time, friends. Kevin may not be here for very long. Oh. Yeah, Kevin's like, I'm she out She is here. on a wild adventure, and she can decide where she wants to go and when. I think we found all right. She wants to go that way. Kevin's adventuring over this Pardon way. Everybody. Kevin's gone. Bye, bye, Crystal. Kevin's gone. Bye, bye, bye. Bye, bye, bye. One of the coolest additions to uh, Animal Kingdom, in my opinion. I think it's just so nice to have Kevin walking around. Kevin is the best. Kevin, Kevin is the best. Is the best. Kevin is the best. I've always said that. So I was just walking by this popcorn uh, booth and I had to show you guys. They got Kumba, they got Timon popcorn buckets. This one's like 20. She said 23 on this and the canteen's about $15. Very, very cool. Also, I wanted to show you guys. They have some special, you know, adulted beverages here. The Honey Bee Citrus Blonde Ale. I like the can. And the Tiger Eye Gold Ale. Both of them are $11.25. Time for a little uh, merchandise. Merchandise. <laughs> Here at Discovery Trading Company. These aren't new, but they are pretty darn awesome. I love these ears. It's very, very earthy tones. You know what I mean? Like, look at that. What do you think, Queen? Do you like those? I think they're nice. I think they got a good vibe. I like that material a little bit well it's almost like a burlap sack kind of thing you know but you know your materials I know what I'm talking about sometimes 
fabrics. My, fa <laughs> my fabrics. Oh, look at these pillows. Oh, you know what you can do with these pillows? A pillow fight. <laughs> now that is nice, see? And it's that same material. And it is still funny to me. I've talked about this before in other vlogs and to other people. I want to know when the going price for a pillow was $40. $40. When did that happen? All right, let's see how their mug game is. I like the way it looks, but I can already tell. The handle. <laughs> it is a beautiful. But it is a beautiful mug. I like how they did all the animals with the tree of life in the Mickey. I think that's really nice. And 20 bucks. And what's cool is when you're drinking, you know, in the morning, you wake up, having your hot bevy out of here, you can be wearing this shirt to go along with it. How cool is that? Say Yeah, that's fun. It's like a fun shirt. That's what you drew. I, I could tell, I mean, a little bigger size, but I would rock that. I would rock that. So if you're a pin collector, or if you're thinking about getting into like the pin trading thing here at Disney, because it is back, in case you didn't know, they really brought it back full steam ahead. Um, but they have these really cool, like you can get small ones, you know, like that. They're to, yes, I know, to put your pins in. Like, so let me show you. You put your pins Sorry, in here. the pins in here. My bad. This so it's a small one. You put your pins in here. It has little perforated things. So I guess yeah, you put your pins in your cell phone, a cell phone case. But I came over here because I wanted to show you this one. This is the one that I love. Look how cool this thing is. And when you open it up, no way. Check it out. This is for if you're serious about doing pin trading. Bam. See this. So you put all your pins, and it's like a book, so you can go through them. You know what I'm saying? See what I'm saying? And decide which one you want to trade. And decide which one you want to trade. And I think Queen brought some pins today, so she might be doing some pin trading. Uh, let me let you know. 50 bucks? 50 bucks for that? Not, I, I think that's a fair price. But yeah, if you're into pin trading, you gotta get one of those bags. So what'd you find, Queen? Tell them. Tell them all about it. <laughs> Uh, Wally, and we were just talking as we walked over here and saw these there is not a lot or I should say there's not enough like Wally -E stuff I love the movie Wally -E. I thought it was brilliant and I'm actually waiting for them to make a second movie because what they could do is make the second movie of them going back to earth Ooh. just saying just saying oh my. And she that almost looked like she almost looked like E.T. <laughs> E.T. <laughs> like out of the corner of my eye when you grabbed her, it looked like E.T. But the little sloths from uh, sloths Zootopia. from Zootopia. Oh, you can't forget. I always forget his name. I want to call him Zach Wild, and that's not his name, right? Or is it? I don't think so. No, I know that's Judy Hopps. I always remember yes, Judy Hopps, um, but I can't. Oh, Nick Wild, right? Nick, Nick. Wild. That's how do you name. know? Do you read it? No, I didn't read it. No, it just actually came to my brain. I thought of things and it happened. I know a lot of you uh, like the munchlings and you know, they become like a big thing. Little ones, you got big ones up there. But I was just looking in this case, I was like, oh, these are cute. And then I noticed they have Jack Skellington. He's a cupcake, it looks like. That is awesome. I feel like I want or need that one. That is really cool. And what did you find, Queen? I'm not sure if these ones are new, but I know. They're new, they're new to us because I don't recall seeing these. A little uh, s'more Baymax. Do you, do you like those? Would you rock oh, those? Yeah, these You would rock those? Yeah, it kind of looks like the ghost is from Mario. Oh my gosh, you're right. What do you guys think? That does, look, hold on. Bag, you know? Hold on, show the, show the front again though, if you look at it real quick. Yeah, it does. The only thing separating it is that line. Yeah, that's really cute. That is cute. And yeah, a bunch of more uh, Munchlings ornaments. And they have the mug. They've got the mug down here, which I've showed this before, but I just think it's adorable. So, and it's the three finger uh, handle on that bad boy. What you can do is... Tell me, can... tell me about it. You can get this here yeah oh and you can feel like you're getting s'more in the morning s'more in the morning s'more in the morning that was a bad joke i'm sorry everybody i apologize for that one Doo -doo -doo. 
Do do do. Do do do. I'll tell you. It's Disney Springs and Animal Kingdom. They have the most beep boppy. Yes, it just gets you ready. You know? It really does. But uh, we're going to head over to the Pandora area and see what kind of trouble that we can get into over that way. Let's go. Let's go, Drew. Run, run. Welcome to the Valley of Moana, Pandora. Oh, look at that thing. It always reminds me of an onion. An onion? An onion. Well, it's an onion that's spitting out water right now. I don't think we need any more water because the, the rain's coming. But this thing looks awesome at night, though. I mean, all of Pandora looks awesome at night. Even with the weather being a little inclement, it just always looks beautiful in this area. Look at Queen just strolling around. It's so nice, like it's so calming. Very, very zen, relaxing, uh, very meditative over here. Oh, just gorgeous. We always love to just share how pretty you know, parts of the park are. Man. Especially at night. I always tell people, if you've never been to Pandora, you need to come at nighttime. That is for sure. Just to give you guys an idea how crazy the wind is, look at all the water from that waterfall in the middle of the walkway. Like, it is just blowing at everywhere. So strangely enough, it's the weather's really, really sketchy today. And I know I've been telling you that throughout this whole video, but I figured there wouldn't be as many people. It's an 80 minute wait for Navi River and 70 for Flight of Passage, which is crazy to me that Navi River is more time than Flight of Passage, but, right? But uh, we figured we'd show you guys I just heard thunder. This is a big boy. I wish they would make this so it would like walk around oh, around Pandora. How cool would that be? Oh, they have some the nuts in here. Yeah, the Pongu Lumpia Navi Slice Pretzel. This right here is such a great drink. It's called the Night Blossom. And it reminds me, uh, taste wise, of like a sweet tart. And then they have a Rum Blossom, Wara Margarita, and your, you know, draft beers. So if that's what you're looking for, you just jump right over here. There's usually not that big of a wait. Going to Wind Traders, and that's kind of an appropriate uh, name for today, you know? A Wind Trader. Seems it's windy, see? see? I know. <laughs> she didn't think it was funny. <laughs> so I want to show you guys, these are some of the coolest things ever. Look, look, check it out. They move. What, see, can I make it move? Can I make it move? When you shake your, <laughs> when you shake your grooves on. Oh, there you go, there you go. So, but I want to show you guys, these are the uh, little banshees. You buy them in the egg and they're interactive. And they, like if you had two of them, they like interact with each other. It's pretty darn cool. They're $40, but they're super cute. They're fun, you know. They're cute. I like them. I like them. They look like little baby banshees. Like just, I know they're smaller, but I mean their faces look very babyish. They're just big babies. Okay. Oh, look at them! Look at them go! Like every time. Every time. Wait! Don't move! Don't move! They're gonna, they're gonna move if you don't move. Get ready. Wait for it, everybody. There we go. See? We weren't lying. They really do move. And they have all these glowing in the dark merch. Oh my goodness, this is adorable. Those little babies that you carry around. Just looking at some snacky poos. They have not gummy worms. What are they? They're called Pandorian, oh, they're Pandorian worms. Excuse me, they're not gummy worms. They're Pandorian worms. Ooh. But those look really good. They, you know what? They must have gotten the ones for the but drink. Must have came over here in Pandora to get them. Looks like a gummy though. I don't know. I know. It does kind of look, like, look like a gummy <laughs> worm. Yeah, that's me. And what else? What else? Like what I, I got to admit, it it doesn't feel like 
looking at it doesn't really look appetizing. It's a Rice Krispie treat. Oh. But they're calling it uh, a lion berry. And it's mixed berry flavored flavored crisp rice cereal treat. <laughs> it actually looks like uh, from the show, uh, One Piece. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. The, the, what do they call that? What, what is the fruit? Monkey fruit or something like that? It's called monkey fruit. And if you've never seen that series, you need to check it out. It's amazing. But yeah, it just didn't look super appetizing to me. Maybe it's probably delicious. So. A while ago, over there, they had Neytiri, the, the princess avatar, but they've actually moved her right over here. So if you thought she was gone, she's not. They just moved her, and this is going to be... Really, one of the coolest busts. Like, it looks, she looks alive. She really does look alive, man. Crazy. It has now started raining. We, we're just leaving the store. A little bit of rain, so thank goodness I brought my trusty umbrella. There we go. Check it out. Ooh, nice. Yeah, look at that. Hong Kong, Shanghai, Paris tourist. You gotta come prepared, even if it's not gonna rain that day. I would still suggest bringing an umbrella because it will, while you're waiting in line for rides and stuff, to shelter you a little bit from the sun. Mm. Just a, you know, just That's a helpful a hit. Too. Helpful hit. Woo! So this is kind of a cool shot in the rain. Look at this. <laughs> It is a blustery day here in Animal Kingdom. But so we decided, since it's just so crazy, uh, we're gonna head over to the Bugs Life and go check out that show uh, for a little bit. Yeah. Get out of the rain and because uh, that show over time, I feel like it's gonna go away. So, uh, so let's head over there right now and get out of this rainy, windy oh, craziness. Let's, let's do it. Right next to A Bug's Life, we noticed when we were walking over here. So we're gonna stop here first. We're gonna go meet Doug from Up. We have never met Doug. This is our first time. I'm super excited. I hope you guys enjoy, and I hope you get a chance to meet Doug as well. Come on in, friends. Doug! Does Doug like hugs? I like hugs. Oh, you know this is my first time meeting you. First time meeting Doug. Love you. I love you. And do you know what I have a problem with as well? Squirrels. Now say hi. <laughs> I'm recording. Oh much my God. love, much love for Doug. You look amazing. <laughs> They're getting their pictures up. All right, so let's get out of the rain and go into It's Tough to Be a Bug. Ten minute wait. I'm excited because the last time we were here, it was a while ago, but we were with our kids. Remember? I remember. Because they, they hadn't been on this, uh, this attraction for a while. And I remember as, as children, it actually kind of scared them a little bit. Because it's a little, it can get a little intense. But I'm a big boy and I can handle it and I'm excited. Wow, the, look at the wind, man. But uh, that wasn't what I wanted to show you guys. I wanted to show you the, uh, the cool, you know, where you walk to get to this attraction. Look at it, it's, we're going in a little cavern. Under the tree, nice work. Where it is dirt and stuff like that. I don't know, I'll, I'll have to think of a song later on. What you do, you actually feel like a bug, like going through the, going through the earth and the dirt. Best animal ever. These signs are great. I love to stop and take a moment to like appreciate the details. It's the little things, you know? It's the little things. Chili, and then this is the, I love these guys. The Dung Brothers. Here we are, guys. Oh, uh, yeah. I think we'll get maybe this back row. I think this back row will be good. This is such a fun show. And it's a lot cooler in here. Oh my goodness. Oh, this is going to be fun. You hear all the crickets, Queen? No, I hear it. <laughs> here we go. Oh no, Queen broke her glasses. You broke your glasses? 
Uh-oh. Queen's gonna have to tape them together. And this is a, uh, uh, you have to get 3D glasses, as you can tell. When you come on here, I'm gonna try to put them on the camera so you guys can get a little bit of that. Buzzing, stinging, and pollinating. And no chirping. Thank you. And now, put your wings together for the host of our show, everyone's favorite act, Lick! Fireflies, fireflies, up here. Over here. Whale. Whale, little more. Little more. Little. Less. Earth. Oh, and hi. Hi, hello, and, 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 and welcome. Welcome to our show. You know, we've been doing this act for over 300 million years. And with Buzz making up more than 80% of the animal world, we're the biggest cast of them all. So that's Neat, huh? Yeah, no, now you're all honorary bucks. So, uh, on with the show. Okay. Okay, thank you, Bill. You're done now. Huh? Why? Why that? Off the moon? Yes, yeah, thank you. Oh. Take it from an ant. It's tough to be a bug. That's why we've developed some amazing survival techniques. For instance, deep in the jungle of South America, there's a bug. No, technically, he's an arachnid, you see. And. Uh, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Shorty, Shorty, I really hate you that. I really that. I hate Oh, I'm sorry, Nick. Where? Nicole. Where was I? Yes, um. Chile and Francis, my, my friend Chile here. Yeah. Throw poison quills at their enemies with deadly accuracy. I never miss. This is my favorite. She's on a roll. You are over your target! 
big black widow spider. Jump! <laughs> Zappers, sticky little motels. Nothing can stop us. Ha! Nothing! If it weren't for the fact that we like the taste, you'd be out there wallowing in shoulder high waist, shoulder high waist, and in all the ones with white dust, the face of the planet, they're zooming on you, man, so from here to man, the first thing about us, you can't live right now. Piece of cake. And it's moldy! Well, it still has a few bugs in it, but that's our show. And now that you're all honorary bugs, remember, magnifying glasses are for looking at little things, not for burning little things. See ya! When the show started, Queen... Broke her glasses. I broke my glasses. I gotta give it to a cast member now, so yep. don't put it in the same bin. That's right. Your poor glasses. I hope you guys enjoyed the show. I tried to do as best I could yes. by putting the, the 3D glasses onto the camera uh, so you guys could enjoy it, feel like you're here with us. Um, but it is so much fun. But as you can tell, some parts are very intense. Yeah, like the spiders coming out. The spiders, yeah. And there's like... Um, in case you did not know, there's like water that gets sprayed at you, air, like it's, uh, what is it, we, 4D? We got a good amount of water. We got a good amount of water. In the back. In the back, so I don't All know. the way in the back, so we didn't bother anybody. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to warn anybody that has younger kids to, you know, if you think they'll be okay, then go for it. But uh, I, I know a lot of kids, they, they kind of freak out. But look at this view when we get out. How awesome is that? We're on like the back side of the um, Tree of Life, like over here. Yeah, like right over there, that's where uh, they used to have the sitar player, uh, Chakranati. Chakranati, uh, unfortunately, uh, he he's no longer with us, but uh, so much fun watching him over there. But yeah, it's like such a cool, different view that you don't always get, because not everybody goes on the Bug's Life. You know what I mean? But uh, all right, guys, well, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, we're going to end it here. It's getting a little rainy, and it's only going to get worse. Uh, but thank you for checking out the video. We hope you had fun with us. Uh, we hope you hit that subscribe if you did. Hope to see you in, you know, some comments. Maybe leave a comment on this video. Let us know what you thought. Um, but, guys, have a wonderful day. Thanks for joining. Until we see you next time, remember, only one way to live. In the moment, guys. In the moment. See you next video.